Hi everybody, I am Danny B of Danny B's Closet and today I'll be doing my first ever TMU review. Okay, so if you have been anywhere on social media, you've probably seen these orange bags um, or you've heard people talking about TMU. It's like the latest online shopping craze. Um, I've been wanting to try it, but because I was doing my whole um, non-shopping uh, little thing I was doing for myself, I just, you know, was window shopping. <laughs> so, uh, if you were to look at my TMU uh, shopping cart right now, it looks worse than Amazon. So, it's pretty bad, but I just, I, I know, I just wanted to wait to see, you know, what the quality of the items would be. And to see, you know, what what it was all about. Because when it first came out, I heard a lot of rumors about, you know, they were selling people's information. And people said they were being hacked and et cetera. And so I kind of waited a, a few, you know, months, let it die down. Like the initial craze of it die down before I tried it. And then I was given the opportunity to try it for free. So that's where this video comes into play. Um, I was given the chance to order a certain amount of, um, of things to do a review. And if you've ever watched my channel, you already know I'm going to tell you guys the absolute truth as I see it about, you know, the quality of the items, the shipping and et cetera. Because a lot of times, you know, we you order from these types of companies and sometimes it, it's cheap, but the quality just doesn't make it worth it. I mean, you might as well spend a little bit more money to get something that's going to last or that's going to do exactly what it's supposed to do. So. That's where this review comes in. Um, if you see anything that you like, I will put the links below. Um, and I hope you'll check it out. Also, in my uh, description, there'll be an opportunity for you guys to get free items as well if you're interested in those things. Um, and then I will come back a week after um, I have shown you guys everything and kind of do a update to let you know if it actually worked, if it lasted, etc. So let's jump in. This is what it looks like. Um... As you can see, I think something happened to this um, in shipping. We have had a lot of bad weather in my area the last couple of weeks. So I don't know if it got damaged in transit, if it was shipped to the wrong place or what. Uh, so let's talk about shipping. Anytime, we order, anytime I order something from these types of websites, when I, I say websites, you know, like this, I mean like the Shein or Sheen and, you know, Chick, uh, I think Chick, it, Chic, wish and all that other stuff those little um affordable style websites the shipping is usually terrible uh for this it took approximately a little over a week um i had free shipping this first time now my only issue is i couldn't track my package and for me living in an apartment i like to be able to track well actually living in this area period i like to be able to track my packages now my area is pretty safe as safe as any place can be. However, we still have porch pirates who do steal packages. So I like to, you know, be able to track my packages to know where they are. So when they're delivered, I can be near my house or, you know, ask somebody to stop by and pick it up. So for me, that was the only con with the shipping. Like I say, a week is not that bad. And it's, you know, this bag is pretty secure. So hopefully what's inside was not damaged in the uh, transit. So let's now i'll tell you the truth because i really don't remember what i ordered it wasn't that long ago but i was trying to get things that i could use for my business so that even if you know it was just free items it would actually be something i could use so here's my first item It just says charcoal. It does not say what it is. Ooh, okay. So, uh, right now there's a there's a craze called I think the Stanley Cups is what it is. It's supposed to be, I guess, in my opinion, like the new Yeti. And I have seen a lot of dupes all over the place. So this is supposed to be a dupe of the Stanley Cup. My friend actually got one from one of our local stores and she loves hers so i decided i could you know would try this especially in the summer here in mississippi the heat and the humidity is very disrespectful so i wanted to try this 
and see how it works. So it does not have any papers with it. There's no specifications as to how long it'll keep something hot or cold. So I have to go back online to do that. And then I will come back, like I said, in a week and do an update to let you guys know, you know, if it, if it, you know, stands up to what it's supposed to be. Now, I don't own a Stanley Cup, but I do own several Yeti Cups and I love my Pioneer Woman Cups. And you guys will hear my son in the background. I've asked him to lower his voice, but he's four. So good luck with that, right? Anyway, so that's the first item. What's that? Okay, just a piece of paper. The next item, ooh, this is smushed. The next item I got was this mini electric iron. And I got this again for my business and for traveling. I have a steamer, so I technically didn't really need this, but I thought it was so cute, so I decided to take a chance on it. So this is what it looks like. It's very lightweight, so got to be careful with that. Maybe this is how you open it to put water in it. Uh, it does come with a little cup for to add water and it has instructions and I guess this is the cooling plate or well yeah it's probably the, the cooling plate okay so this is adorable like I say very lightweight and I hear something shaking so hopefully it wasn't damaged in transit because this box, like I say, has seen better days. But again, give me about a week to try all of this out. Um, a week is not an extensive time. I mean, honestly, these are affordable items. So they probably won't last a lifetime. But a week is enough time for me to see if they actually work. And if, you know, it does a decent enough job to waste your money ordering it. Or, like I say, you can click the link below and you can try your own free item and see what works for you. Now, I will be reusing these, this bag. So, even if this stuff in here is terrible, I love a good bag. Okay, so this is a laundry bag. So let's hope that okay so as i was saying this is i had to pause and talk to my son this is a shoe laundry bag and it is very thick you guys um if this works i will be ordering more than one of these um if you like me if it's a pair of sneakers i'm going to sell and they're disgusting i will throw them you know first i'll kind of clean them up and then throw them in the washing machine with some um disinfectant and all of that Okay, so I love the feel of this bag. You guys, it is really thick. Um, if it works, I will be ordering another one of these. Actually, probably several of these. These will be perfect, you know, when I'm washing my own uh, sneakers as well as my husband's shoes. Um, I could throw a couple of my son's shoes off in here, his little play shoes. Um, but really, I bought it for my business. When I want to, you know, wash sneakers or a small little purse, this is perfect. I love this. And it's like I say, it's really thick, you guys. Um, this is good quality and I will put the links in the description because like I say, if this works, I will, I like this one. I like the feel of it. I can tell it's quality. Okay. I ordered the most random stuff, you guys. <laughs> but I was trying to make sure I used all of my money um, that was allotted to me. And if you are a reseller, at some point, you will need a scrubber. Um, not only that, I am in a rental apartment for the time being. Um, so a temporary apartment. So mine is being, it's finished being remodeled. So it's the little things. Like I say, it was an opportunity to get some items to test out and share with you guys. So 
I saw these, they were like, I think less than a dollar. And one side is your sponge and one side is your scrubber. And I can use one in the kitchen and then I can use the rest of my business for my shoes and you know, cleaning out purses and whatnot. This actually might be really good for um, leather conditioner application. So I'm excited about these because at my uh, feet right now are several purses that I brought over from my other apartment to clean. So excited about these. Okay, so the next item. Um, this was a really random, and these are long. They're much longer than I thought they would be. This is a 15-piece needle set. Look how long that is. Okay, so I like to sew. I won't call myself a seamstress because I don't have the quality qualifications for that anymore. But I grew up with my mother and my aunt who are seamstresses and I love to sew. Uh, if you ever watch my channel, you will know I love to order the rehab boxes and upcycle and mend things. So oh, don't look at my nails. I have not been to the nail salon um, like I should. But with everything going on in my life right now, I've been a little crazy, but I will make it there. So these are really large um, needles. The eye is really large because with age, eyesight has a tendency to go down. Okay, so I ordered these simply because, like I say, I love to sew. I like to mend it up, um, upcycle items, but my eyesight is not what it used to be. And these were like, I think 50 some, 59 cent. And so, oh, so it's different sizes in there. It's 15 total, but you have the really large one and you have the medium size one. So that's perfect. But the eye is large on all of them which makes it easier to thread the needle. Okay, this is self-explanatory. If this works, that would be wonderful. This was like $3.49. So I'm gonna keep my expectations at a minimum, but it's supposed to be a lightning fast iPhone charger. Uh, if this works, I will most definitely update you guys because if you're like me, my iPhone chargers take legs and walk away. Oh, and no one ever knows where they went. No one ever saw it. Oh, it was on the counter last time I saw it. And then sometimes I just forget where I, I forget where I put it. You know, they stressed me out. <laughs> anyway, so I'm gonna try this out, you guys. And if it actually, you know, charges my phone quickly in a week or so, I will let you know. Okay, the next item, budget planner. When I saw this on the uh, options of things I could get, I jumped at it because um, I'm in the midst of a 90 day transformation. And one of those things is budgeting and saving money. I've been paying off debt for the past two or three months and it's been going, but I have a tendency to shop my, my emotions when I get stressed out. You know, I want to eat out, I want to do a little thrifting and I use my phone to budget, to kind of keep up with everything. And so sometimes that, you know, it's good to put it on paper. I'm old school. I like the feel of paper and, you know, a writing utensil. So I decided to try this out. Um, this is what it looks like on the inside. So it's not too tiny, um, which is what, that's always my concern with these types of books and um, if they're like more affordably priced. Sometimes it's so small that, you know, it's not useful. I, I write large, so I need space. Oh, I love this. This also would be good for me as a business owner. This is great. I mean, keeping up with, you know, what I've purchased. Oh yes, I love this. This would be a great way if I want to keep up with, you know, what I spend over the course of a month, like track my inventory. This is really nice, you guys. And I think the cost of this was like $1.49 or $2, something like that. Um, but yes, this is great. Especially if you're a small business uh, reseller like me. I, I, I think I have less than a thousand, well, a little over a thousand um, items. But I'm clearing out a lot of stuff and, you know, changing over things. So hopefully in the next month or so, I will be under 
a thousand items. So, okay, I have two more items in here, you guys. And wait for the total. Um, I was not given a healthy budget um, to spend, but I found items I could say I could use. Oh, I love this. Look how pretty that color is. That ombre, that is so pretty. So this is an inspirational water bottle. Uh, 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. is get started. 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. is remember your goal. Uh, 10 a.m. keep chugging. 11 a.m. don't give up. 12 p.m. or 6 p.m. almost there. And 1 p.m., 7 p.m. you did it and then it says refill. This is so nice. Uh, this will also make a really great gift. And then on the back, you have your measurements if you're doing like a shake, which is what I do in the morning for breakfast now, um, or a smoothie. This is really good. Um, I like this. So this right here doesn't feel like the sturdiest. So I would have to be careful with it, but it's pretty. And honestly, only thing I wish it had was like something to carry it with, like a little handle. But not too bad overall for that, like just, you know, looking at it. Okay, so this is my last item, you guys. And I was just looking at it when it came out the bag. Uh, this has taken a beating and it's partially open. So I don't know if my bag was tampered with and that's why it was taped up the way it was or if. You know this happened in shipping so this is a zero nine advanced portable electric fan five hours of use time maximum power four watts soft wind and i got it in the white color i think white and pink um so first let me say there is no instructions to it unless they're on the box and it has the little charger that comes with it this is what it looks like. Oh, okay. So this is charged up. Okay, so it has more than one speed. It has three speeds. Okay, so three speeds. Okay. It's kind of loud, but it's lightweight. So this is not bad at all, you guys. Um, I don't know if it'll send up to the Mississippi heat. But, again, I'll say I'll let you know in a week when I take it outside. Uh, when I go to my mom's house out in the country, I'll let you know if it stands up and if it, you know, blowing out straight hot heat. Or if it at least gives me a cool breeze every now and then. So, uh, there you have it, you guys. Those are all my items. Um... At first glance, I like this. Like I say, it's kind of lightweight. I could throw it in my purse if I wanted to. Um, it says five hours of charge time. So I will test that out and let you guys know, you know, if that is up to par. The charger, you know, iPhone chargers are hard to hold on to. These needles, forgive my son. Uh, these needles. It may be a while before I can actually use these just because I'm not in my home currently and I did not bring over any of my mending items because it would require me to bring my sewing machine, my sewing kit, and then all of the stuff. So I don't know if I can do that one just yet, but this I can for sure try out. I'm going to start using this immediately. And then I have the scrubbers, the iron. The washing mat, which I, my husband will be here as soon so I can use his shoes to try that out. And then I have my Stanley Cup dupe, of which I'm really excited about because this mug is huge. This can be used for a lot of things, adult beverages as well as healthy beverages. So I will for sure try this out and let you guys know how long it uh, keeps my item cool in or hot. So there you have it, you guys. Don't forget to hit the, uh, the links in my description if you want to try your own free items um, if you haven't tried Timu or downloaded the app. Also, if you're interested in any of these items, I will try to put a link for each one. And if you try it out, let me know. 
uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed um because i do plan on coming back in a week to let you guys know how everything worked so there you have it you guys my very first timu review and honestly at this point i can say i am first um impression pleased with everything that i got i think i did a great job oh and my total cost you guys was i think 49 dollars and 47 cents so even if this stuff does not work, even if the only thing I can use is, you know, the budget book and this cup or whatever, overall, it wasn't, it's not a bad experience, not a bad opportunity to try some of it. And I will for sure be going back to my own shopping cart if all this stuff, you know, works out well and trying some new things on my own. Just because like I say, I have about, I'm gonna put it on the screen. I think I have like a hundred plus things in my shopping cart that I really want to try. So there you have it you guys let me know in the comment section your experiences that helps anybody else out who watches this and you know reads that so bye everybody